Hey guys, welcome to the Pega free tutorial series. In this tutorial, I'll walk you through how you can create a Pega integrator to connect to a web service. So you may ask, so what's Pega integrator? Well, Pega integrator can be used to connect to any third party applications or any of the web services. So first of all, let's go to the Pega designer studio, go to integration, then connect us then I'm gonna create a create soap connection. So, but there are a list of other options available. You can create the rest integration as well, which is very popular nowadays. So let's, but let's click on the create soap integration. Then over here, you need to provide the whistle. So either you can upload the whistle from your local system, or I'm, I'm just gonna Google sample with a whistle. Then if you just click on that, it opens up a new whistle URL. Just copy that one over here paste the URL of here, then click on next. But guys, make sure you are giving the whistle format correctly. Otherwise it throws an exception right over here. Okay, now you can see the list of operations available. So, so it really depends which operations you specified on a whistle. Based on that, you'll see the operations name. So over here, you can test your operations as well. So I'm just gonna click the get cities by country, which is a sample uh, whistle. So if you click on text, test that brings up to another window over here you can pass the value whichever you want so i'm just gonna pass as of now new zealand then click on test and that should bring up the result okay there you go as you can see on the right hand side the list of results so it's on the tree view you can you can make it to xml okay there you go you can see the list of cities in New Zealand okay you can change the view as well over here to tree view so if you if you would have run on a soap so that would be on a JSON format okay then click OK click on next so over here you can define your name so the integration layer so over here you can define web service test test or you can say the classes over here you can define the main classes as well so it, that brings up the list of classes which were already predefined which is a bit of an advanced concept but yeah as of now you're just going to click on if you want to publish into no we're not going to publish in jms so it was code auto test all right so then you can just hit on create that will create the first integration layer for you so as you can see you have learned how you can use the pega integrator to create a integration point to the third party web services thank you